I've just been trying to get the watch both sides of uh, people that voted. You know, what they say after the election and stuff. And uh, <clears throat> if you think about it, people say, wow, this is all we got to vote for. These are the, This is our choice. And then they say they got you got to get out there and vote. And nobody wants to vote for anybody up there. But they say, well, you still have to vote. And yet, you don't want to vote for any of the people. You just do it because it's one side or the other or this or that. You don't agree with a person. He might be there. He might be your party, and you don't agree with either one of them. So you just vote for your party, and uh, you call that freedom. I don't call voting for somebody I don't want freedom. I don't call voting not having a choice of who uh, gets nominated voting. I, I don't see any of this. I see it all being controlled by the government. For their agenda. I don't see a people's agenda anywhere. I don't see a country's agenda. I see a, I see a give me some votes if I help you out agenda. And that's all I see. I don't see a country agenda. I don't see a, a constitutional agenda. I don't see anything anymore. I see a bunch of greedy people looking for votes. That's all I see. And, and, and you all vote for them without saying, oh, I, you know, I don't want to vote for any of these people. Nobody backs off. Nobody protests saying, hey, I want, uh, I want, <clears throat> we want to vote for who we want to put in the office. It's not like that. It's, you know, it's, anyway, that's all I'm saying. You all voted for somebody you didn't want. Whether it was a party or, you know, maybe you're, maybe you're just a sloppy mind. that don't really have any uh, integrity and you'll just take whatever you can get. And so you grab an agenda, wrap it around your sloppy brain, and it stiffens you up a little bit. And you walk around, you know, thinking, uh, yeah, I'm tight wrapped now. Anyway.